Good morning, guys. I am sorry to announce that I don't think I did too well on that exam on the history one. I really, like, walked in there confident, like, after studying, after writing all those notes. I thought I was going to do wonderfully. But, I don't know, I feel like the professor really screwed me, at least, over with all the questions he did. They were so seemingly random and obscure. And is that really the point of the class, to know random, obscure things about diplomatic history? Or just no diplomatic history? I'm not pleased with how I did, or how I think I did, because I won't know the results until, like, maybe next week or something. I'm kind of mad at, you know, the professor and the questions he picked, but maybe that's just me, you know, that's definitely, like, what I think. Maybe they were fair, but, you know, based on what I studied and how I studied, it didn't, it didn't work, so I'm a little bummed. I'm a lot bummed, actually. But, in good news, I got a B in German, and, and the finals are over. That was my last final. It is Friday. It is 1.30. I am done with the fall semester. I'm sorry I'm not more happy, but the, the exam kind of put a damper on my, uh, on how I'm feeling today. And also, I'm still kind of sick, so that doesn't help, and I didn't sleep much because I was studying for the damn test. Okay. Me, I will stop bitching. Because this is not what this is for. This is not for me to bitch. This is for me to remember the good things. Not to bitch. So my sleeping pattern has completely gone to hell for the finals and studying and be not having classes in the morning. So yeah, what do I do at you know odd hours of the night? Uh, laundry. Because that's when the laundry machines are open. Because everyone's getting drunk or something elsewhere. I can hear them coming back from the pub and stuff. But yeah, I know I'm just them being a cookie, doing laundry. Because I don't want to leave soon and I hate packing dirty clothes. Because does anyone else know I feel like all the clothes you pack just have to be clean? Or else they like stain there and contaminate all the other clothes. Or if that's just me being OCD or something, I don't know. Oh, and thanks to a comment made by Una, kind of. Um, so I was complaining about the clarity in my video and like noticing other videos and how clear they were and how mine just weren't clear for some reason. Um, I found out that I had not the wrong setting um, on my video editing software, but just an improper one. And so I've edited it, and now you can view these vlogs in 1080p. Who'd have thunk it? Not that anything exciting has happened in the past week or so besides me spilling coffee because for some reason that. That one is kind of funny for me. Yeah, I kinda, I'm kind of lame, right? I am. I, everyone's out in the club, I'm in the laundry. Because the washrooms are open at like midnight. Um, but see, isn't that weird? We only have two washers and two dryers for the whole building. So, and no like organization or time slots or anything. There's like underwear in the corner. That's not mine. That's just here on these couches. I don't know. January 24th or something. I think that's when I start school. The 23rd, the 24th, whatever that Monday is. Um, that's when I start school, so I'll be here the Friday beforehand. Um, yeah, but until then, so I'll be in Romania in a month. And now that the finals are over, I can look at a calendar and go, wait, Christmas is like in a week. I did not realize that. I knew it was December and then Christmas was gonna happen at some point. However, I did not realize that Christmas was in a week. There will be Romania vlogs in the near future. So, this week, two weeks of unexciting nothingness that is my life will be more exciting once I'm in Romania. Because I can do things and see things and take the metro and eat weird things. My relatives are picking me up from the airport, my aunt and my uncle. And I was like, alright, I'll call you on Saturday, you know, before I leave. She's like, well, Saturday we're going to be in the country. I was like, oh, where? Why? She's like, oh, well, we're going, you know, to the country to slaughter the pig. <laughs> you got a little Eastern Europe. That's, that's a tradition, I guess. I don't know exactly, like, when, but I know either it's sometime late December, a pig is slaughtered, and you make 
make all the wintery foods and sausages and things preserved in lard from that. Some part of me is kind of sad that I wasn't there to see this thing because it's, it's, it's part of like Romanian tradition so I feel like I should see it happen at least once although it's very, you know, it's now being slaughtered. It's kind of somewhat barbaric and crude but it's also tradition so it's not, you know, I, I don't know. I kind of regretted not being there but also kind of happy that I didn't have to hear it because I think that's that's the thing for me hearing that like pig squeal death squeal I think that I would like silence of the lambs right I've never seen silence of the lambs but isn't that like she hears the lambs being slaughtered I think it would be something similar